When the coronavirus cut short Tim Bateman's rugby season in Japan, he knew coming home to Christchurch would be a testing time. But Bateman's always looked beyond rugby for his income, and now it's paying off. Here's Matt Hall Smith. Tim Bateman has constantly got his game right on the field and has always been open to new opportunities offered. This whole scenario reinforces why, why it is really important to try and have other things going on outside of the field. The 32-year-old centre has been running his float club business in Christchurch for the past five years and recently opened a modern wellness centre, O Studio. He's long understood the importance of a secondary job as rugby braces for major upheaval. Athletes are really entertainers at the end of the day and if you can't have people getting together to be entertained, um, it's very difficult to sort of um, to generate any income from it. So uh, rugby players aren't exempt <clears throat> to, this, to this issue. Uh, um, shivers, it's a tough one though. Off in the backline brains, he's now shifting gear again for his business during lockdown, taking his O Studio classes online. At the last 48 hours we closed, we filmed 48 yoga classes. <laughs> and so we're releasing six a week. Um, but we, yeah, so six go out on a Monday. And he's got a message for the next generation. If I was at home now and I was just started my career, I'd obviously be training really hard, but I'd be spending that time outside of training, really thinking about what I should do to set myself up post rugby. Something Batesman has already laid a platform for as his lengthy playing career winds down. Matt Hall-Smith, One News.